Hello everyone, welcome to CS Academy. Today I am going to show you how to add list into the PDF file. In the last video, I shown you how to create this PDF file and how to add the paragraph into the PDF file. Today I am going to show you how to add the list into this PDF file. Let's get started. Let's open your Eclipse. I will copy this same project. And I will paste that. I will give the name as PDF file list data. Expand the project and go to this source slash main slash java folder. This is contained two packages. One is com.example.demo and another one is com.example.demo.service. This service package contain one class called pdf file service.java. Uh, inside this I wrote the code to create the pdf file and add the paragraph into the pdf file. Now here itself I will do the modification to add the list. I will erase this paragraph. Now I am going to create the list here. Import com.itextpdf dot layout dot element and then add the values to this list list that add list dot add that's it I created the list and I added the values to that list after that I uh, using the document object reference I need to add that list into the document that's it save the file and I will uh, name the file as a simple list dot pdf I gave the file name as simple list dot pdf and save the project and run the project application started to run and pdf file got created now go to the destination look at here I got the file here simple list look at here I'll, I got one paragraph also and list of element what I stored into the list that's it now I am going to show you how to create a table into this PDF file let's go to the Eclipse and copy the same project and paste here I will name the project name as a PDF table and copy and go inside this project and go to the com.example.demo.service package inside this go to the pdf file service class and make a changes here I will remove this paragraph and list I will remove this also first I created the variable to hold the file path and then I created pdf writer object and then pdf document object and then document object for this PDF writer object I'm passing the file path and then PDF document object I'm passing the 
PDF writer reference and then for the document I am going to pass the uh, PDF document reference. To create the table I need to first create one array uh, to give the column width. I am going to give the four columns. First, we need to create the array to hold the column width. I gave the array name as column width and then I need to create the table object. And for this table, I need to pass this column width and then I need to add the cell to the table. Using the table reference, I am adding the cell. I am giving the first cell name as ID. First name and last name. And then email. For that values I am adding here. First ID is 101. Name is Sachin. Email like this. Sachin at gmail.com Sachin at gmail.com After that I need to add this table into the document to add that I need to use the document reference document dot add table that's it I change the file name as simple table dot pdf the first I created one array to hold the width of the table and then I created the table object after that I am adding the cell for the table and then I added the table reference to the document and then I am closing the table here. That's it. Now save the file. Go to the runner class. Inside the runner class I am giving the statement as table is added. I gave as table is added into the PDF file. That's it. Run the project. Run as Spring Boot app. Look at here. We got the output. Application started to run. Table is added into the PDF file. Now let's check into the folder whether our file is got created or not. Look at here. We got the file. Inside the file we got the table also. Now I done with adding the list into the PDF file and adding the table into the PDF file. If you like this video please hit the like button and subscribe to my YouTube channel. Thank you for watching. Have a nice day.